good evening everyone uh, <laughs> i am not very good at speeches and uh, i made it very clear that i can't give any speeches i will be doing only a question and answer session but i was thrust here okay i thought if i can handle bahubali maybe i can handle this too <laughs> um as i said i <laughs> i don't know how to give speeches uh, we'll be doing a question and answer session soon so uh, but before that i just like to tell you uh, uh, one experience of mine uh, before i uh, i worked in uh, different aspects of uh, 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 film field i i worked as an assistant editor i worked in the recording theater for a few months i worked as an assistant script writer to my father i worked as an assistant director etc etc then the first chance i had to direct something was uh, i did an ad film for uh, for government of andhra pradesh uh, a social message ad uh, uh, mr k raghavendra who was my mentor gave me the job of directing that ad i i i first uh, narrated him the uh, the concept he liked it and uh, he asked me uh, and there was one mr mukherji who was uh, uh, assisting assisting uh, uh, raghavendra gar in uh, in getting this ads done <coughs> so mr mukherji asked me yeah the concept was good but who is going to direct it uh, raghavendra ru said uh, rajmol is a confident guy he will he will do he will do it himself uh mukherji was not so sure because so many people were coming to direct the ads and most of them were turning out not to be so good and uh, uh, i had no prior experience so he was a little bit uh, worried about how i am going to go about it but raghavendra ru said uh, no he can do it and the next day i went to the shoot it was my first day of shoot i got down there the unit van came the light boys were coming getting down with the lights the art department guys were setting up things junior artists were coming the costumers were putting their costumes and i was uh, shivering from my from my toe to my head i was literally shivering i was uh, shaking i had absolutely no confidence about going further i didn't know what to do i of course we had the uh, uh, we had the uh, uh, storyboard was there the short division was made uh, we know where to keep the camera what to do everything but but the confidence was not there what if everything goes wrong what is the first shot if it doesn't go wrong if the actors do it wrongly how do i correct it i, I didn't know i was completely scared and on top of that uh, i was standing on a small rock uh, from a distance i saw mr mukherji coming on his scooter to check on how i was doing uh, how i was going ahead with the shoot and uh, it will take another 1 minute for him to come from the scooter to to my position to see that i am in not a position to shoot so at that moment all i could think of was if mr mukherji comes here and sees me shivering my career is done so what i have to be is i have to appear confident i know i was not confident but i cannot let it uh, uh, show to him i cannot let it uh, show on my face so as he is getting down the scooter as he is uh, putting the stand to stand to the scooter i started shouting i started shouting on the art guys i started shouting on the cameraman on the light boys come on put the light here i don't know what i was talking but i was <laughs> just shouting and uh, i was giving keeping on giving giving instructions some of them were right some of them were wrong now mr mukherjee is not a filmmaker all he could see was that there is one confident guy who knows uh, uh, what he's doing surprisingly the light boy who knows who should actually know that i was talking nonsense was also feeling that i was telling him the right thing because i was appearing confident so at that moment uh, uh, okay uh, mr mukherji came patted on my shoulder and said yeah uh, good job go ahead i haven't i haven't shot anything as of yet he said good job and go ahead so i realized uh, 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 slowly that 
uh, what the industry needs more than the talent is the confidence. Uh, this is not a right story to tell you who are coming into the industry, but uh, the ground reality is something different. Uh, uh, you have, uh, you did your, uh, I don't know whether it's a diploma or uh, undergrad course, but you have done it, you have learned so many things and uh, uh, I can't tell you uh, what is a good shot, what is a bad shot, because I haven't learned anything. Forget about uh, film education, I haven't even have the formal education. So you guys know better than me about the film grammar, but what I'm talking about is the uh, ground reality when you come and uh, come into the films. We in the film industry, of course, it's a fantastic uh, world. You'll create worlds that have not existed before. You create characters that are never seen before. You create a complete new life. Everything is great about it, but going through the task, you will face hell. Let me uh, not make it rosy for you. Let me not give you any... Uh, 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 let me not cheat you. It is a very uh, 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 dirty world a dirty world out there <laughs> dirty in the sense we people here are uh, very confused being in the art world we are uh, accustomed to exaggerate things right uh, uh, like a lot of exaggerations that you were telling about me when you are speaking we we are uh, 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 we exaggerate a lot uh, nothing negative about it we are we are artists we do that uh, uh, that's a part of uh, being an artist but gradually what happens is we start believing in those accolades uh, see in general uh, the success rate of film industry is very low only 10% uh, of the films succeed and most of us don't know why the film succeeds so when uh, when film succeeds most people started uh, starts uh, putting so many accolades on us starts praising us and gradually we start believing them no, uh, we start uh, believing them, but the fact is no one knows uh, why a film will be a success or why a film uh, will not be successful. We'll never know that. It is, in my honest opinion, uh, it is a waste to uh, you know, try to make a successful venture because no one ever knows, believe me, no one will ever know. The best thing you can do is you do whatever you feel like what what excites you, you no know? and in that process you have to uh, lie to so many people uh, like like i was lying to mr mukherjee i was faking my uh, confidence you will have to be untruthful for so many people in the process of becoming becoming what you want to but never be untruthful for yourself you no know, you can lie to whomever you want you cheat whomever you want in the process of uh, uh, getting where you want to be but never cheat, cheat yourself never uh, 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 yeah I think that's it <laughs> be truthful to yourself that is the main thing that you uh, that you have to be uh, I don't know what I'm speaking but hope uh, something gets <laughs> got across to you and uh, we'll be taking uh, questions we'll be answering as truthful as we can. Thank you very much.